The Saints, as I predicted, would beat the Cowboys. So they beat the Cowboys on Sunday night, 12 to 10. I'm so happy that the Saints won. Overall, they played well. The offense scored enough points to win against that hellacious Dallas defense. And speaking of the defense, the Saints defense came alive against the Cowboys offense. To hold that dynamic, explosive offense to only 10 points was fantastic. That Saints defense put forth a Herculean effort. They held Ezekiel Elliott to 35 yards on 18 carries. As we all know, that is very hard to do because the Cowboys have one of the best offensive lines in the NFL. So for the Saints to hold them to only 35 yards, I give them mad props for that. So Cameron Jordan deserves kudos, Eli Apple, Lattimore, Bell, Marcus Williams, they all deserve kudos, they, they deserve props, they deserve any accolades that comes their way for holding down the high-powered Dallas Cowboys offense. I give them major props. The Saints offense did a good job too. Now, they didn't score any touchdowns, but hey, that's okay. At the end of the day, they scored more points than the Cowboys, they kicked their four field goals, and they won the game. So, I'm good with that. And I know that the offense will continue to improve with Teddy Bridgewater starting for them. And he will get better as the season progresses. So, I'm not concerned at all. And then when Drew Brees gets back, look out. The Saints will be even better than they already are right now. They're 2-0 without Drew Brees. And I'm happy about that. Both sides of the ball, the offense and the defense are stepping up their level of play. They've beaten Seattle at Seattle. They beat the Cowboys at home. So they've defeated two quality NFC teams. So I'm happy about that. And we know that both teams are tough. This, the Seahawks are tough to play, especially in that loud, raucous stadium of theirs. And to play the Cowboys is tough because the Cowboys offense is, is very hard. It's very hard to stop. And then their defense is difficult as well. They've got pass rushers. They've got linebackers. Uh, J, uh, Smith and the other guy, number 55. Lathan, I believe his name is. And they have a nice secondary with the Woozy A. They, they've got talent on that defense. So... For the Saints offense to just score enough to beat them, that's good. It's hard to score points against this Dallas defense because of their pass rush and just the whole defense overall is tough. So I give the offense props for hanging in there and I give the Saints defense tremendous props for what they did. That defense brought their A game. And they'll get better as the season progresses. Like I said, I'm not concerned. I've still got them making the Super Bowl, and they're just further proving my case as to why they're going to be playing in Miami. We saw it on Sunday, and like I said, they'll keep getting better. They'll keep improving. Any team that plays them is going to be in for a long, hard day. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. You should definitely subscribe to my channel. If you have not done so already, just press the red subscribe button below this video. If you did that, I'd really appreciate it, and plus, you wouldn't miss out on any future content that I posted, so you should definitely subscribe. Thanks again for watching, thanks for listening, I hope that all of you have a blessed, wonderful day.